hi guys welcome back to our youtube channel and today i'm so psyched i'm so happy to be doing this with you because um it, i know it will help a queen or two hold their relationship together and before that kindly let's subscribe and also hit on the notification bell so that when we upload a new video you'll be the first one to know and uh, feel free to share like and comment so in here we discuss sure ways on building long-lasting love relationship that often lead to marriage and since if you're not looking for marriage and uh, you're looking for connecting deeper and having deep relationships, then you are also in the right place. So today we're going to talk about how to move up the ladder from being a doormat girl to a dream girl. And I'd st I'll, I'll start by saying that uh, the doormat girl is often known as the nice girl. I know, it's funny, right? And uh, this is a woman who will overcompensate. Give everything to a man she barely knows without him having to invest much in the relationship. That is sad, right? And the woman does that expecting attention and reciprocation from the man. And uh, I know that most of us have been here at some point at some point of our lives and uh, we don't want to linguish at the same place. We want to move up the ladder. And, and here is where I introduce the attraction principle and we're going to do this in a contrasting manner where we see how the doormat girl um, runs her thing and we also see how the dream girl does. So in the attraction principle, uh, it says that anything a person chases in life runs away. And I'd say this is true. And especially when dealing with men, uh, if you chase him in a black night, he first he'll have sex with you and then he'll run. Do you agree? Tell me in the comment section if you agree. And uh, you'd, you'd ask, why does a man run from a situation like this one? <laughs> why does he need to run? But he runs because the woman's behavior doesn't suggest that she places a high value on herself. So kindly note, I'm talking about the deep and uh, long-lasting relationships. I'm not, I'm not talking about the, um, the, the one-night stands and uh, etc. So the man will run away because the 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 relationship is relatively new. There's no bond that the the if if there's a bond, the bond is relatively shallow. And uh, here she is; she's already dealt him her best card. This is a woman who uh, will do their second date uh, at her place. Would even prepare a focus meal for the guy and even serve him in uh in her nighty or in a sexy lingerie or something of the sort. And uh, we let's have a look at the dream girl. A dream girl, on the other hand, uh, won't kill to impress anyone. And this is, and this is why uh, the man falls in love with, um, with this woman, because um, this woman um, will maybe invite this guy six months, um, will maybe invite this guy to her place, uh, six months after they've dated up in, in about six months and maybe she'll prepare popcorns and ask the man should I serve you in my pan or should I pass the ball you know and um, when they continue this uh, when the same woman throws together a meal maybe just a simple meal and uh, put the plate in front of the guy this guy will say to himself man I'm special and it doesn't matter if it's if it's badly cooked, poorly cooked, if it's only pasta. Um, in his head, it, he'll be like, this is the best pasta I've ever had in my life. And he'll feel like a king. Now, the only difference is the amount of time and effort he had to invest first. So in the first, in the doormat girl, there's no, the, the man is not investing anything. In fact, it's the woman who is investing a lot, expecting the guy to reciprocate. And in the second one, uh, the dream girl, the man has really has really invested. The the they've gone on several dates. The guy has really tried to have this woman um, do something, but the 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 girl is not breaking a back for him. So when he when she does, and uh, he he really feels special. He really feels special, and. Um, in the first woman, the doormat girl, the guy will either assume that either she's desperate or she's willing to sleep with any man 
right away, uh, which is not good. So that that is the difference between the doormat girl and a dream girl. And I want you to tell me in the comment section which which lady are you? Are you the doormat kind of girl? And are you the dream girl? And don't be embarrassed to outline where you lie because we're helping each other in this in this journey. Feel free to comment and feel free to share this. I'll be doing a series every every week, maybe twice a week. Uh, so stay stay close by, stay keep subscribing, keep sharing, and uh, we'll move we'll move up the ladder from being a doormat to a dream girl. And I want to hear the testimony.